Um, that is a lot of protein. It's not to say that we can't consume the additional protein, uh, but is it conferring a benefit beyond a certain point? I think it becomes a case of diminishing returns. So the figure that Stephen and I quite often use is one gram per pound of body weight as a ballpark figure. Um, we need a minimum of 0.5 grams per pound of, of body weight um, to allow us to heal and repair uh, and not lose anything. But in order for us to grow, we, that figure needs to be 0.82 grams per pound. This is why we use uh, the number of one gram per pound, because it's okay to go over on the protein. Now, this is for a normal person who does a little bit of training, likes to keep fit, um, but it's very different when it comes to extreme sports like bodybuilding, uh, So, which I'm guessing MJ is doing as he says he's currently on a bulk. So if we increase this to around 1.5 grams per pound, so let's see what this is. So the 196 multiplied by 1.5 gives us 294. So around 300 grams of, 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 of protein um, is going to be sufficient. So we need to be careful that we don't add in additional or excess body fat because we only have to lose this when it comes to either just looking good or competing, for example.